This Halloween, tap into your inner superhero. I'm going to show you how to transform into the world's most beloved cartoon character, Sailor Moon. I'm so excited. I've been dying to be here for years, so I'm finally going to do it. We're going to kick it off by putting the wig on first because I really want to get into the spirit. Now we brow, or unbrow. Get rid of them using either a brow wax or a primer. I'm using Tarte's Timeless Smoothing Primer. This is going to help flatten and matte out my brow so I can put concealer right over it. Then after I'm done with the eyebrows, I'm going to take a little bit more primer and put it all over my face for a nice smooth matte complexion. Now completely get rid of the brows by applying concealer right over them. Follow that with a little bit of powder. Pack it on, don't be afraid to use too much. Then I'm taking our Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation in Fair, and I'm literally buffing it all over my entire face. I mean all over, lips, eyes, you name it. And this is going to give me a more alien-like look. Pack on some powder right after that for a creamy, smooth, matte finish. Then I'm going to take the foundation and put it right over the brows, buff it right in so it kind of matches my whole complexion. Then I'm going to take powder, dust it right over, smooth everything out. Powder it up, ladies. Next, I'm going to use the Inner Rim Brightener to really open my eyes, and I'm going to apply it to the upper and lower lash line. This is kind of going to wash me out, but that's what we're going for. Now it's time for mascara. Finally, some color. All right, really pack it on, layer over layer. We want lashes that are out of this world. I'm sorry I had to. Now we're going to put a little bit of concealer on the lips to wash them out as well. Next up, contouring, AKA my favorite. So I'm going to give myself a more slenderized look, so I'm going to go really heavy into the hollow parts of my cheekbones. Don't be afraid to go a little heavy, guys. It's Halloween. Then I'm going to give myself an instant nose job, putting a little bit of bronzer right on the sides, a little bit of concealer down the bridge, and this will immediately slenderize my nose. And next, we highlight. We're going to dust it right over the cheekbones, we're going to go right over the cupid's bow, chin, and right under the brow bone. Don't forget the bridge of your nose. Now I'm going to take the inner and brightener, nude out the rest of my lips. Next we're going to take the lip color. I'm literally just going to draw a little heart shape on my lips, smaller than my natural lip size. I'm using Tarte's Power Pigment in Fearless. It's like the perfect shade for this look. Voila! And lash, but not least, lashes. We're going to give ourselves a little bit of a doll-like look, adding a couple single lashes right to the bottom lower lash line. I'm going to say lash about five more times. I'm using these Darling Lashes by House of Lashes. They're my fave. Finally, I'm gonna take out these bobby pins, let my real hair down. Just kidding, it's obviously like. Next, accessories. Sailor Moon does not, I repeat, does not leave the house without her headband, and nor will I. So, I'm putting mine on now. And now for the finishing touch, I'm gonna put some blue contacts in. It took me about 30 minutes to put these in, so I recommend putting them in before you do your makeup. I learned the hard way. And that's it. Solving crime by dinner time.